So it's been a while since my last upload, and I'm sure that some of you are thinking where I've been. Life has been a little bit hectic lately, and I had to take a time off to recharge and refocus. But now I'm back and I have some news to share with you all. But before we dive into the news, I want to address you a little concern I'm having with this channel. If you've been following me for a while, you might have noticed that I try to approach different areas of computer science. For example, you can see that in one of my videos that addresses Web3 technologies, or another one that addresses more of a front-end approach and another one about full stack and another one for AI and so on and so forth. And it has been my goal since the beginning to tackle the most that I can of computer science in general. Unfortunately, it's just me on this project and I see now that I cannot pursue this goal while still delivering to you guys quality content on time. Therefore, I made the decision that this channel, from now on, it's going to be only about game development, specifically the Godot game engine. And before I go on, on to why, for those who have been following me for my general computer science content, don't worry. The old website will still be up and accessible, and all of the previous content regarding general computer science content will still be accessible for you to revisit whenever you want for free. Now, the reason why I chose game development is a little bit personal. So it has been my dream since before I got onto college on computer science to actually make a living making video games. Unfortunately, here in Portugal, the game development market back then was not that good and there were very little opportunities for me to pursue. So I took the safer route. Although that didn't stop me from learning game engines in my spare time. So I learned Things like Unity, Unreal Engine, shaders, how to implement your own JavaScript engine from the ground up. And fortunately, I am now in a position on which I feel comfortable and have enough time to share with you guys what I know and to learn more about game development with you guys. And not only that, but I really liked working with Godot. I was actually quite surprised. One thing I do value as a programmer and a developer is using tools that give you the liberty and the creativity to build more complex projects while still maintaining the simplicity and being intuitive as a developer. And for me, Godot checks all those marks. So from now on, this channel's main goal will be to help you guys build your own games. I do completely understand that you've came onto my channel because of web development and maybe game development is not what you like, but I can assure you that I'll try my best to actually give you some kind of value. So stay tuned. I'm also working on a brand new website for you to access resources, courses, projects, everything you need to set you up and get you on the right track to build your own games. So I'll be sure to let you know once the new website is online. And a big thank you to all of you guys that supported me up until now. And I really do hope to see you on this next chapter of this channel. So until the next one, cheers.